333 as I start your message, my beautiful people. So, for some of you guys, this is something that's been completed. Okay? This could be, somebody here could be calling it quits. Or there's a cycle that has ended between you and someone. So, they can't do something anymore. That could also be it. Um, there could have been three tries here. Of you guys working together. Um, some of you guys been through counseling and therapy. This could even be marriage counseling, marriage, uh, marriage therapy. This can even be spiritually. And at the time, it's like three strikes you're out in the old ball game. That's what I just heard. Somebody here could be a baseball fan. I feel like for some of you guys, you had to humble. Yes, you had to humble yourself or come to some kind of humbling, grounding, um, just really putting yourself in place, even with the universe. And this could help you. You could have had to rely on outside uh, resources, and these resources can also represent friends. It could have been embarrassing and shame. This could have also been you having to deal with some kind of embarrassment and shame in front of your friends. For some of you guys, this might make you emotional. Okay, guys, let's tap into this and see what's going on. If you don't know already, I am your Shaman Empress, a.k.a. The Shaman Hummingbird. If you don't know already, I will be reading all the signs and the energies that I see here for you guys. Please make sure that you're also signed up for your areas only placements. Love Tarot that you are subscribed, that is. Okay, there could be something that someone here is signing up for. Okay, or air, anywhere areas is in your chart, your person's chart, or any karmic energies, attachments. You have messages over there, so make sure you're clocking all your tea, honey, because you're only getting some of it if you're not subscribed. Okay, if you need me for anything more personal, everything you need to know is down below on getting yourself books or personal readings. Um, sometimes I do them on Saturdays and Sundays. Okay, for the next couple of weeks, I'm trying Saturday, so they will be done. They're done once a week on Saturdays, okay? They are Zoom readings in... Your camera is optional on Zoom. If you don't know already, again, I am your Shaman Empress, a.k.a. the Shaman Hummingbird. They wanted me to repeat my name to you guys for some reason, so I don't know. Um, but that's who, that's what this is going on. That's my name, baby. Um, whatever's happening here can be happening physically and or spiritually between you and your person. Please make sure that you are also understanding that this is general messages. So take what is for you. Simply leave what is not. Okay. This person think you are sexy. The energy is fluid and it will fluctuate back and forth between you and your person. Either you fan as hell or this person is. I just heard fan as fuck. Somebody here says that. Like, damn, we're fan as fuck. Like, or something. Okay, what's the next move? What's the next move? Mm. Sideways. The lovers, yeah. Someone here don't know if they... You, child. Things are moving very, very fast. Uh, oh, yep, the strength cord between you and this person. The five of swords. Okay, somebody here also likes to play mind games, but you catch, catch on to them real quick. Um, is all, This is why this is ending, or this is why for some of you guys, you're going to end it with you and this person. Yeah, we got the pages. Oh, uh, and the eight of swords. Now, I'm going to tell you something. For some of you guys, this is also somebody here that's going to jail or they're dealing with some kind of jail time. You don't know that. Um, somebody here could be, they don't know if you're going to hold them down or they don't think you are strong enough to hold them down. I don't know, like, if you just, like, met this person or you know this. Because they, they were being watched. They were being investigated. Yep. They, they were. Someone here thought they had the perfect plan, but things changed quickly. Now, others of you guys, this is uh, spiritual jail. This person could be going to spiritual jail for something that they did. They have to pay out some kind of debt to the, uh, like, the universe. Um, what it would look like for us is society. Um, this person sends you a lot of squirrels. I need to look something up, too. Some of you guys played the, the violin when you was in school. Yep, the four cups. So, this is somebody here is, uh, like, currently uh, going through karma. Thank you, Holy Spirit. They showed me a deck they want me to use. Um, going through their karmic deck. I need to see something, too, guys. Yep, that's what they have to do. They have to put that work in. And they have the relationship. Yep. And to be honest with you, this is someone here, to be honest, they are in karmic debt to the devil. This is something that they are paying. Honey, somebody here is paying back something they did. 
This could be something toxic, something that you don't know, whether this is spiritual or physical. They is going to jail. Yep, and they're depressed about it. Look at this. Five of Cups, Scorpion Energy. They're very depressed about it because this come out of time uh, 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 that they want to have a relationship with you. Four of Wands Energy. That could be your twin flame. Gemini and Tesaurus, Leo. Aqua Arius. Air Benders are here. Gemini, Libra, and um, Aqua Arius. Uh, um, very strong Gemini and Cancerian. And your overall layout, there's no wands here. That's why this, this person don't know what action. This is could be why this is completed. It's like wrong timing. Because they have to, they're in, you know, right now they can't really manifest with the universe. For now, for some of you guys, to be honest, this is like eight years of like debt. They can't manifest. Their money's going to be fucked up. But this is what they're going through. And they can't even really afford to have a relationship. There's no dating. They're not happy. They're fucking miserable. They were sabotaged. It's like, that's it. Now, you're supposed to go through, um, you know, with somebody through better or worse. So, for some of you guys, that would be a choice to make because you um dealing with somebody at a very bad time. And this could be a twin flame and or soulmate energy at a time where they're doing, they're going through this. Now, they did this to you, and you still choose to do this with them, and, the, and God is telling this person, the universe is letting them know, nope, you still got to pay that debt. Whether I don't give a damn if y'all if would, or whatever, because lovers is here. This is either you or an ex-lover they did this to. They, you, you can choose to go through it with them, but they're going to experience this. We have 8458. Eight. Let's look at your angel number here, guys, and then we're going to go a little deeper. Okay, guys, angel number 8458. 8458 is urging you to celebrate the small victories in your life that keep you inspired and motivated to continue working hard. If you are going to get on the journey with this person, they will have small victories. Um, it's going to take little out of time for this person to build, and your guys is going to have to take it one step out of time, all right, to keep you guys inspired, to keep the relationship alive, to keep the fire burnt so you guys can keep moving forward. Because the things that this person has to, the debt that they're going to pay or the debt they're going through, there's going to be tough times. Someone here wants to know, can you stand the rain? I just heard Missy, Missy Elliott. Can you stand the rain? They want to know if you can stand the rain. Hmm, okay, let's see what the Eight of Swords is about. What did they do? What's the Eight of Swords? Ooh. Intimacy issues. STD, common infections, UTI, and infer inf infertility. So, for some of you guys, someone here could have been caused to go infertile. Or this could be you. This could be why you're infertile. This could be somebody here that kept giving somebody the same STD. Uh, this could be a UTI. That's why you've been getting UTIs or something like that. Or this could even be a um, a spiritual STD. And this could be why you can't have se like not sex children. Or this is what they were doing to people. What the fuck? Hating on your body image exercise routine. And they was hating on you, sending you negative energy. Venus retrograde. Yup, dealing with insecurities, appearance, body issues, radiance, relationships, and sexuality. I don't know if some of you guys knew that. So someone here, they were lying to you as well. This person lies. They also won't tell you what they're going through or how they're feeling. They'll lie first. And this could be someone here things move fast with. And you didn't know this. What else is going on here? Keep a protection pouch on with you. For some of you guys, you need to protect yourself from this person. Whatever you need to put in that pouch, put it in there. I don't give a fuck if it's space and time. That's it. Yep, or you need to get you an amethyst. Amethyst will help with that. Um, psychic protection, control, spiritual energies. Yup. Because for a lot of you guys, this is a spiritual energy. A STI as well. Dreaming, it can cause, it, it can help with insomnia nightmares. Do you understand what I'm saying? Okay. That's what's going on. Hold on, child. We got to pull something else here. Hold up. Even burn you some. Some of you guys need to get Palacentia. 
Um, and also lavender. Or maybe sage, sage sticks with lavender in it. Yo. And this could be somebody here, child. You Maybe you they knew and they wasn't telling people. So maybe they did this to other people and then they tried you. It's like for some of you guys, this could have been three other people they did this with. Yup. Boom. Lovers. And you are like their fourth person. And it was like, that's why I heard three strikes are out. So it was three. They did this to three people already. That's why I heard and you're out in the old ball game. And then the game was played. You the fourth one that came in. And you bust this shit out the water on this person. Now, for some of you guys, to be honest, you may not know. Maybe some of you guys don't know because of spiritual reasons why you can't conceive anymore. It also could have caused you some kind of friction because, you know, especially if the birthing process, that's a time that you are giving life offerings to the universe and this, and this energy, it could affect the child. So God could allow like, you know, this to happen to you, but it wasn't supposed to because you were spiritually infected. Child, this is, this is, yup, the Ten of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. Yeah, and they were playing, child, this person was playing house with, um, with people. They like to lay up and play house with people. That's what they do. Yup, the Ace of Pentacles, and they move on real fast. And for some of you guys, this is somebody here, that's what happened. Yup, the Eight of Pentacles, the Four of Wands, and the Nine of Wands, and the Nine of Swords, but they're scared now. Mmm. Um, what they lie about? What they lie about? Some of you guys got like a, a gray white cat. Someone here likes cats, big cats as well. You could be into like lions and shit like that. Tigers could be like your favorite, like, you know, um, animal or something like that. The three of cups in reverse. Yeah, that they wasn't fucking with other people. Wasn't dating other people. They were three of ones. This is somebody here. This is what they was doing. They was doing this. To, for some of you guys, there could have been, I told you, three other people. Yep, the Eight of Cups. Boom. They could have walked away from you or you walked away from them. Yeah, the Six of Wands. For some of you guys, they walked away from you because they was getting attention from other people. Okay, what's, what's, what's going on here? Yeah, uh, hold on, guys. 12.44 on the timer, y'all. That's another angel number. Honey, when I tell you your spirit guides, ascended masters, also could have uh, been protecting you because this person wasn't doing the work. This could be also someone here that was like could have been warned in a spiritual um, realm to like, you are fucking infected. Sit your little ass down some goddamn wear. <laughs> Period. Like, sit your ass down. You're doing way too much. What else is here? Hold on. Okay, yeah. And this person does watch you. Uh-uh. This person here could have been watching you to see if you had this. I gotta say something. Somebody here sits with people like three or four times before they move on. Because that's when they, 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 they're affected. And, it, yep, the seven of pentacles in reverse. All of a sudden, they ain't got time no more. All of a sudden, everything is wrong with you. This was a bad investment. They will also try to, yup, here it is, change. Flip it like it's you that gave it to them or you're doing something wrong and it's them. Yup, the Ten of Cups and it's them. They'll never tell you that, you know, that you're, they're actually like happy with you or something like that. Damn, y'all. What's the lover sideways? We're going to pull some tea on that, too. What's the lover? Uh -uh, they don't want me to. They want me to use the other one's true emotions. What's the lover sideways, Jemenian energy? That's why things change so fast, so abruptly, so quickly. This, damn. Hold on, y'all. The seven of ones. For some of you guys, they blocked you. Yep, they did and quit talking to you. The eight of pentacles. And you, and you, it could have left you thinking that you wasn't doing something right. 
putting out working, but you was. They was just being sneaky, seven of swords, because they knew they betrayed you with doing because of what they knew. Yep, five of swords. This was all a mind game. They already knew about this. Yep, two of cups. And this is somebody here that really do like you or some shit like that. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Mm. What's this right here? Yeah, marrying each other. No strings attached. See, they really did like you. Y'all was on the same page with that. But there was no strings attached because it is. This is crazy. What's, what's going on here? GPS in reverse. Spiritual gifts. Yeah. So for some of you guys, somebody's spiritual gifts, is, they, could, they lost their gift. Now their gift here, when God gives you spiritual gifts, your gifts are, you know, part of the spirit room. So you know. Because you have to manifest them. Whether you sing, you write, you in the music, you're in this. This could be why this person is not having no luck. Eight of Pentacles and the Four of Cups. They, they could have been um, out of work, losing work. Yeah, I told you. This is part of their karma. <laughs> they can't even manifest money right now. Jezebel. Because they was fucking Jezebel. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> All for Jezebel's spirits. Was it worth it? Was it worth it? Karma. Damn. Okay. What's the five of swords? I'm sorry. Show me the four of cups first, please. Some of you guys could have just ate some kind of peppers. Peppercornia or something. Six of cups. Yeah, karma. The queen of pentacles. You might not know your person changed. This karma could have changed them. You or me and somebody here or dealing with somebody that's going through karma. And they could have did try to do this shit to you too. Yep, four cups can't make it up. Oh, mm. <sighs> Give me some more on that. But they got like a plan. They're trying to get y'all ahead faster as well. Yep, ghosted. This is, oh my gosh, this is why they ghosted you. Yeah. Oh, we got memories. Yep, and I miss you. See, look at this. And for some of you guys, you close this cycle. You close this cycle. Because you had to. Yep, karmic lesson. Damn. Child. Oh, my gosh. Yep, and this is bad news. This is bad news to you, Queen B. Whether you're a man or a woman, it don't matter. It's just energy, guys, so you know where to put this. So what's the plan? Show me the aqua bearer. What's the five of swords? What's the plan? And this is a sneaky-ass plan, too. I mean, obviously, they got to sneak back. Oh, this is a lot. Can I get a couple uh, cards? Yeah, this person here could still be dealing with this. What's the... Um, Damn. Okay, that they are making a decision. Nine of Wands to defend themselves about what you don't know. And they know this might draw a lot of confusion. But they feel like, um, you know, you I, do they want a relationship with you. Yep, they do. For some of you guys, it's somebody, they love you, honey. This is somebody that love you, but you did not know what was going on, like, on a spiritual level. For some of you guys um, here, they could have... This could be physical. Take it how it resonates, guys. Yep, that's the truth. The truth is they was a whore. A hoe. Yeah. They, um, yeah. Se highly sexual. What's the Five of Swords? Show me something else on that. The Ace of Cups. Yeah, because they, they you're a mature woman. So with you, they are a man. So with you, they feel like they can, like, clean up their act. Yeah. Like, and they like that. It's a different, it's a change. They want people to look at them different or something like that. Yeah. For some of you guys, see Thief. Now, this is the thing, though. For some of you guys, to be honest, this could be somebody here that's going to try to use your energy to kind of change their reputation. Yep, expectation, the Ten of Swords, yeah, uh-uh, no. 
And that could be something, and yeah, that, that may bother you. Or you are in a relationship with you because like to, 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 but you are to give you, there's something about you that's very mature. So it gives them like a new look and it changes their reputation. So this person's getting on my goddamn nerve. Let's see what else is going on here. There is no plan B. Do not disturb regeneration and process. This could be somebody here that's cutting people off. Um, they don't want no more plan B's as well. Okay, because of what they experienced, where it got them. But you you bring a like a new you're a breath of fresh air to them. What else is going on here? Child. Mm, mm, mm. Say it three times. I don't care. I told you there's three other people they did this to y'all and they didn't even give a fuck. They didn't give a fuck. This is somebody here, you know, their sexual urge, they needed to be pleased, and they took chances, knowing that they still had spiritual healing to do. Now, to be honest, like, you know, when you do certain spiritual healing, you have to be abstinence from, like, fornication, um, sex. They could have been told eight years, and that could have been tough for them. They could have, uh, so let's say they tried for a year or two. And they felt like, well, maybe I healed enough to where I can have fun because they're sexual eight years in, in spiritual jail, no sex. Now, if they did something to society and they had to go to jail, you know what I'm saying? Like, eight years they could have did. And now it's like they are... Somebody here, uh, this was like physical. Let's say they got like five to eight, six to eight. And they did six out of them eight years. They still had to basically... They could have been like... Okay, so they let's say they had six to eight. They could have been on, on probation for like three. But it was also spiritual probation. And they, they, could, they, should, have, they, could, have been, they should have been doing right. And they could have thought that, you know, they was healed enough where they can start doing this again. Somebody here knew what the fuck they was doing. Point blank period. Yep. You can do it. Now, someone here also was under the impression that they were just going to be able to do it. The eight years was going to be cool. They had to clean herself up, get their spirit clean, their self right for God, and they didn't do that shit. Yep. Nope. They started spreading the love. They, 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 they just, it was hard. It, it sound, a lot of shit, think about it. It's so easy to think that, oh, we got to do is just stop it. Habits or being a way and all of a sudden you got to stop. It's fucking hard to do. And I feel like this person just thought they were going to do it. They, 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 they knew they weren't supposed to be doing something. What do they want to say to you, whether it's physically or spiritually? This can even be both. Oh, patience. This is someone here that don't, they didn't have the patience. Yeah, this is a Romeo. This is a lover. Idealistic, idealistic lover in reverse. They were a Romeo. They couldn't wait it out. They they did it. And they, now, if this is also with you, they did this with you too. They couldn't wait it out. They went to, you know, with you. This person wanted to. And this is from somebody that is a narcissist. Yeah, land of love. But they got love for you. It's like you give them a new opportunity or something. They can live a different life. It will clean up their reputation. Something like that is here. But they still got to do what they got to do, what God said to. That's what's going on here. That's what they got to do. Oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. Let's get this first, guys. Yeah, so they got this is like karmic debt as well. Yeah, honey. They manifesting you. Cause there's a lot of chemistry here, and that's why they want to manifest you because they feel like you could be the one. And they need you to forgive them and 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 learning. Someone here wants you to teach them more about connections, about loving, and you know. Damn God. But this is what they got to do. This is the debt they had to pay. 
Yep, unexpected connection. This is something that's unexpected in this connection. You didn't expect this. That right there. Yeah, you do deserve love. And that's how this person sees you. You deserve love. This is a twin flame. You're twin flame. For some of you guys could have been through this. Fearless love. Yep, and this is, this is why. It's a fearless kind of love. It's burning. Love that you experience with your twin flame. Other you guys is a high, like, uh, soulmate. And we got divine time. And see, there was divine time in here, but they had to do something. This could be someone here that can't come back to you until eight years uh, as well. And it looks, uh, child, please take it how it resonates. I know y'all ain't trying to hear that shit. Some of you guys want to see your person now. Shit, shit is hot. Y'all ready to do it? Shit. Archangel Handle. Yeah, see clear. Archangel Handle, deal with clairvoyance. So some of you guys already know this because they t showed you that. Yeah, see? Some of you guys are getting, it's like good karma's coming in, but they got to pay that bad karma first. Yep, and they're being watched. The watchers, yeah. Mm, the seventh choir is watching them. Damn. Like they better. We got Q and we have L. Some of you guys are Majaz. We got the city. There's something going on with Majaz. These are messages lately that I'm giving for a lot of Majaz. That's also something here. Yeah. Nope, no, that's right. That's right. Okay, hold on, y'all. Let me see. They don't, they want me to use this deck here. Oh, it's right here. Thank you. All right. So let's get it. All right. Yeah. We got thunderstorm. Yep, accept your gifts. For some of you guys, um, Archangel Handle is going to give you something, or your pioneer gland could be like extremely activated at this time. Yep, thunderstorm. And for some of you guys, this might make you mad. Yeah, yeah, in your dreams, sure is. So when you are getting dreams, Archangel Handle is um, showing you shit in your dreams. That's Archangel Handle. Ooh. Yep, sure is. Sure is, Spirit Weaver. Yeah. There's, she's showing you things in the spirit because there has to be rebalance between you and your twin flame or a soulmate before y'all come back together. Y'all running with the wolves because they was running with the wolves. This could be them and a little wolf pack going through this shit right now. This could be them and a group of friends or something like that. Yep, spiritual journey if they want this spiritual journey. That's the thunderstorm that's happening. For a lot of you guys, that's possibly why we're getting like thunderstorms and shit on a spiritual note. Hurricanes, because something's going on with the Majaz. It's fucking with the weather. Yep, gathering. Ceremony. Ooh, child. Ceremony. Yep. And these could be um, spirit of the east. So, uh, spirits watching this person as well. All right, guys. They said one more card. We pull, I'm going to pull from here. Yep, soulless. Yeah, honey. They crying. They crying. Because, see, they. this is like, you know, they, they, they start fucking with their soul. Shit. Someone here got a hoop nose ring. What's the summer rising Venus and North and other uh, um, signs connected to this message? Some of you guys could have just ate an apple, apple power, some shit like that. Some of you guys could have just saw a blue bird. You just heard a certain bird. Some of you guys lay your edges down really pretty. This person cries. We got Virgo. We got Cap. We got Tesaurus. We also have Scorpion. And we also have Leo. Yup. All right, guys, I love you. Um, I hope this helps you out in more than one way. If I resonated with you in any way, go ahead and hit that like button. Make sure you hit that bell. Make sure you hit all. All right, that will keep you tapped in, tuned in, and you'll be notified when your messages are ready. Stay dope. Next video upload, baby. I'll share your name on.